Hello, beautiful souls of YouTube. So this reading, I'm just going to go ahead and get into the reading. If I pull any tarot cards, it will be what you need to know the most. But I'm definitely probably going to pull some psychic cards. Um, this life psychic abilities for you as well as this life mission so we could get into that or alien past lives and past life missions okay and then we have some description cards and some angel numbers and letters so we'll see what we get into okay when it comes to my collective what exactly will they need to wait when it comes to my collective what exactly is their main zodiac sign please you could be a Scorpio Somebody here is a lot of you, okay, a lot of you are definitely meant to step into the spotlight. You're meant to speak some sort of truth, to bring some sort of balance to this world here, okay? Uh, you could be a Libra. But you are meant to speak some sort of truth here in the spotlight. You're meant to get worldwide recognition. And I'm not just talking about like the United States, if you're from the United States or whatever country you're from, I'm talking like your music or your truth is going to be heard all around the world. Okay. Everybody's going to hear you and everybody's going to be talking about you. Yeah. You could be seeing a lot of owls or you could have a pet cat or you could be seeing a lot of cats, like random stray cats that you Maybe you like to pet cats. That's <laughs> what I'm, I'm feeling like. Because I'm seeing like me walk down the street and like seeing a stray cat. And I'm like, come here, kitty, kitty. <laughs> Anyways, so you could be seeing a lot of stray cats. A lot of stray cats could be coming up to you at this time. Okay. You could be seeing owls or hawks. Some sort of bigger bird here. Yes. Yes. The whole world is going to hear you. Like I'm hearing, yes, the whole world is going to hear you speak your truth and it's going to make a major impact on this planet. It's going to bring major balance. Okay. Into this world. When it comes to the collective of my YouTube channel, what exactly is their main Zodiac sign, please? You could be an Aquarius. I'm also hearing Golden Ages. I'm hearing Don't try to play me like a fool because I will simply turn the pages. We have officially entered the golden ages. It's time to move into the next stages of this transition. It's time to stage your spaces. Life is about to change faster than the moon phases. This is a huge part of my mission. I'm just following my intuition. It's telling me I'm the next rap magician. They say I'm limited edition. My music's about to become your next addiction. I put in the commitment and acquired the equipments. Now I have no limits. I'm reaching for the skies. I will not compromise the lives of every human being. We are all one in the same, a part of the same race, living on the same plane called planet Earth, located in the Milky Way. No, it's not a curse to live here. It's time to learn your worth, your lessons. It's time to change your perspective. Okay, I'm feeling like I really need to like get on it with my music, okay? Somebody here really needs to get on it with their music as well, okay? It's not just me because I'm feeling it real strong, okay? But like, I feel like I need to make that song because there's a lot of messages in that song for you guys. Um, for whoever's watching this, I feel like quite a few of you really need to hear my music. Um, I did just make one song. I just refinished it actually, but I have a new YouTube and it's called Rap Magician. Okay, so... The new one is, I'm going insane to the point that it feels like I do not have a brain. See, most people, they say I am super strange, but I'm just kicking it, trying to make a difference. I'm trying to make a change. They say I'm super strange because I'm here to make a change. And they tell me, make a gang, make the world a better place. Okay, so I'm definitely feeling like you guys need to go check out that. If, and if it's not good yet, okay, if you don't like my music, don't hate because I'm a beginner. Okay, I'm recording it on my phone. Um, all opinions are welcome, even haters. You know, like, it's cool. But <laughs> um, 
yeah just like keep in mind i'm not like a pro rapper okay i'm not eminem i'm not mgk i'm not guan okay i'm not freaking dax over here like i'm like hopefully i'll get there okay but i'm not there yet so just keep that in mind like uh anyways you could be a leo and I'm not, personally, I'll tell you, I don't hate my rap music, but I do not like the way that I make beats. I personally don't like my beats, okay? But other than that, I feel like I got this, but hopefully I can, like, work with the beat, okay? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm tone deaf. Some of you may be tone deaf, like, you may not be able to pick up the rhythm, with the beat um like when you rap or when you sing you may not be able to stay on tune with the beat all right and uh i'm like that so i feel like some of you are like that but or you could be like deaf in one ear or deaf maybe even deaf in both e both ears and you still want to make music okay i'm hearing go for it definitely go for it but you could be a Sagittarius here, but what was I? Yeah, I'm hearing, I'm hearing eventually that will stop. You will be able to get the flow going with the beat I'm hearing, but I'm like, at the moment, I'm like, somebody can make my beats, like <laughs> make it on flow. <laughs> Hey, I'm trying though, okay? All right, you could be a Gemini. I didn't mean to pull six cards, but that also represents balance. So, I'm definitely hearing you're about to jump down the rabbit hole here. So, be ready because your mission, okay, it's about to begin and your awakening is... I'm hearing it's about to begin. Like, you may have thought that it had already began, it's about to begin, okay? <laughs> so be ready. Um, you are highly protected regardless of what happens, but just be ready. Be prepared, okay? Take a break right now. Take a rest if you need to. You may be um, wanting to make music, wanting to read tarot, wanting to speak your truth in some sort of way here, but whatever way that is, God is definitely calling you to do this, okay? Yeah, you have a very unique ability. You had this ability in your past lives as well, okay? Yes, God is calling you to step into the spotlight, but right now he may be, you may be trying to step into the spotlight and it's not working out the best or something keeps getting in the way, blah, 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 blah. That's because you're not ready. Okay. You need to love yourself a little bit more, heal yourself a little bit more, and then God will give you the ability to step into the spotlight with no issue. Okay. When it comes to my collective, what exactly do they need to know the most right now about their past lives and or their past life mission? C-U-R-X, okay. Um, I feel like I get this card in almost every reading, but you could have this constellation on your body somewhere and freckles, okay? I actually have it right here on my arm and I was like, it was like driving me crazy because my intuition was like, yo, that's a constellation. It's a constellation. It's a constellation. You live there. You live there. And I'm like, what? What constellation is it? And I tried to look it up for like like quite a few times. And I couldn't figure it out. I finally figured it out though. But you should look up. I think it's also called the Southern Cross. Okay. But it's C-U-R-X. Yeah, I was so... I was like, thank God when I figured that out because it was driving me crazy. It was making me go insane to the point that it felt like I did not have a brain, like <laughs> literally. <laughs> okay, yeah, you are a Lyron being. For some of you, this is your origin. This is where you originated in a past life, okay? And yeah, that's why this cat is here because they're feline beings. Andromedon Galaxy. A lot of you have lived past lives in the Andromedon galaxy as well. You've lived, okay, so I'm getting here with the owl and the cat. I'm feeling like you were definitely Lyron, but you lived in the Lyron constellation, the Lyra constellation as a feline being, but you were also a blue ivy on here. You were also a, a bird being. Um, 
Yeah, and we have the lion over there too. Synchronicities. <laughs> anyway, some of your origins, <clears throat> some of your origins, your original, the original place that you lived was the Andromedon Galaxy, okay? You could have fought in the Orion Lyron War, and that could be why you're here in this lifetime to fight, basically to fight a war. But basically, all you're doing is shining your love and your light, but but you definitely need to be prepared, I'm hearing, because there are some downfalls like you are going to be fighting a lot of demons okay but you are protected and you have the ability to throw a protective shield over your mind body soul and thoughts at any time when you do that these demons will back off okay you could have been a venusian venusian so you could have lived past lives on venus yeah you fought in the montakian orion lyron orion war as well you fought in the mentaki and reptilian war too so you have definitely been fighting these reptilians fighting these i'm hearing grays and dracarians for a very long time now and many many lifetimes which is why you're here palladian okay there could have been a palladian orion war as well i don't know much about that I almost feel like it could have recently just happened. I could be wrong though. You might want to look up the Palladian Orion Roar, okay? You could be, could have been a Greek god or goddess here. Somebody was definitely Aphrodite. P O L A R I A N, Polarian. Okay, so you could have been Polarian here. You might want to look that one up on Google. Somebody's name could start with a P here. I'm hearing Patrick. You could like Jeffrey Star. Lightworker. Okay, you could be a light worker. You are definitely here to make this world a better place, okay? Yeah, Orion, you've been battling with Orion for a long time. You have lived in the Orion constellation quite a few times um, as a Mentakian being because Mentakia was the third star on Orion's belt until the reptilians decided to take over. Anyways, when it comes to the collective of my YouTube channel, what exactly do they need to know the most right now about their past lives and or past life missions? going the same to the point that it feels like I do not have a brain. See most you are here to heal the earth, okay? You most of you have lived past lives as birds in this on this planet. But that also confirms blue ivy on. Yo. <laughs> Literally yeah, you definitely lived a past life on Blue Ivy on for sure for somebody here. Maldek, okay, M-A-L-D-E-K. You may want to look into that. I don't know much about them. Earth Protector. You are here to protect the Earth, okay? To protect the people of this planet. To protect the souls, to heal the souls of this planet. Okay, yeah, we need to get into this other deck. Storage is 